Hello everyone, this is Moon360 here, and I'm just here to talk about something that happened that's really big today in the tech world, that, that is Microsoft's announcement of the an update to the existing Windows 8 operating system known as Windows 8.1 update, uh, which um, may or may not address some of the concerns or complaints from users that are on Windows 8 or considering upgrading to Windows 8. So yeah, today Microsoft announced my Windows 8.1, a update to Windows 8. No, this is not a different operating system. It's just an update to Windows 8. It's not like it's bigger than a regular service pack. Uh, it's bigger than a regular uh, the regular cumulative security updates, but it's smaller than a just whole operating system. So yeah, Microsoft announced uh, Windows 8.1 today, and um, just want to and it's just there's a lot of cool stuff I've found read about it in, on the internet, and uh, just want just want to tell you guys about it and do a little uh, kind of video that shows you how to get Windows 8.1 the preview preview not the official version and uh, just tell you all about Windows 8.1 so let's get started so yeah as I said this is not the final version of Windows 8.1 it is the um, a preview release of Windows 8.1 and um, there, are, it's packed, it's packing a lot of features um, that's that are just a regular updates to as you would just expect from any other updates to a operating system. Of course, you got your typical and performance enhancement stuff. You get. Uh, for example, in Windows 8.1, it gives you more colors, offers more colors and backgrounds for the start menu and ones with motion, improved search all across the board, and uh, improved the Windows Store, App Store, which is uh, this thing right here, and uh, you have apps, more cloud connectivity, so all that s just stuff that you would t you would typically expect in a update because that's what updates are for to give you performance enhancements more features uh, just a better uh, more better than uh, the previous versions so yeah um, if you uh, want to go in depth with if you want to know more about Windows 8.1 um, you ha have to try it yourself because uh, I I actually don't have Windows 8.1 installed yet, but I will. And uh, yeah, but uh, a, a, some few a few notable enhancements to Windows 8.1 is that they brought back the Start menu sort of. Well, it's really not the st Start menu, but um, it it is like the Start menu as you can see here. It's just, it's it's like the new Windows 8 logo, like on over here. So it's so it's like over here, as you can see. But um, it doesn't give you the regular like the start menu as uh, on Windows XP or seven because if you just click on the button, Windows Start button, it'll give you like the pin your pin uh, if I remember correctly, the pin applications and your like information panel, right? But the new Windows Start button just gives you. Um, just uh, gives you this you can uh, just gives you um, a list of stuff as you can see like at uh, yeah just not the original start menu so it's sort of like the start menu but not really and uh, you can also boot to desktop which is uh, probably a, a huge request that Microsoft's getting because people think that this screen is confusing so the start screen because when you first turn on your computer it brings you to the screen the start screen 
not the desktop like before in previous Windows versions so that's why they added boot to desktop so you can directly boot to the desktop screen like this and uh, so yeah and that it doesn't really matter for me but that might help some people and uh, you get more personal personalization as you can see get uh, much uh, improved apps a better Windows Store um, so yeah that, that's what really Windows 8.1 is all about and if you want to read more about Windows 8.1 to learn more about 8, Windows 8.1 I have uh, I'll give you some links in the description you can read or look at so yeah that's what pretty much 8.1 Windows 8.1 is again this is just the preview version of Windows 8.1 it's not the official version and the official version will come later this year as a free again free update uh, you can download uh, through the Windows Store and again this is free and uh, all Windows 8 existing Windows 8 users will be able to download this update uh, through Windows 8, the Windows Store once the official version becomes available but if you just are just like me are curious you can download the preview version which is Windows 8.1 preview uh, this is also for Windows RT which is the I think the surface tablets or the um, other Windows 8 tablets maybe and uh, so yeah this is Windows 8.1 and you can download the preview right now and you can uh, download the preview by just going to this website windows.microsoft.com slash uh, in slash us slash windows 8 windows slash 8 slash preview and you can download the windows 8.1 preview uh, yeah, it's, so tab or click on get the update on this page and follow the instructions and then uh, restart your PC when prompted and then tap or click the message that appears to get the update from this Windows Store in the store follow the instructions to download and complete installation so um, just to if you want to download Windows 8.1 preview just get the update um, just hit that and then it will start downloading as you can see but I'm gonna download not gonna download it now I'm gonna download it later as, as you can see um, again I don't have it installed yet so I don't really know it's like either so and if you uh, have any questions about Windows 8 like the biggest question is probably do you know that you will like keep all your files and your apps and stuff if you want to after if you want to upgrade and the answer is that um, actually if as you can see here it's the FAQ it's the FAQ here, Windows 8.0 preview. It says, if you want to keep, will it, and asks, will I be able to keep my file settings and apps if I install Windows 8.1 preview? And uh, yeah, if you're, you can keep, if you're on Windows 8, if you're upgrading from Windows 8, you can keep all your Windows settings and personal files. If you're updating from Windows RT and uh, Windows settings, personal files, and most apps. So you can take a look at this if you want to know, will I be able to keep my file settings and apps? So yeah, and of course there are risks to installing um, Windows 8.1 Preview since this is a preview. It's not the stable. It's not the most stable, uh, bug-free thing out there. So there might be bugs, and uh, even though it's thoroughly tested, but it's still unfinished, and the, your computer could crash and you could lose files. But again. A common sense is always to back up your data before you install uh, any new operating system. So yeah, if you want to install a point one preview, that's the kind of the um, the risks and the uh, just general info here. So yeah, that's what that's how you get Windows eight point one preview for free, and uh, this is what a Windows eight point one is. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, and I uh, hope you found it informative, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.